happy Friday. If you're new to my channel, my name is Deborah, and today we're going to be working on this gorgeous, gorgeous coat. I mean, look at the details. And it's super shiny, and I'm in love with it. It's super easy, it's fun, so let's get right to it. All you need is a coat you already have in your closet that you'd like to jazz up. Rhinestone applique, E6000 glue, rhinestones of mixed shapes, large and small, with a flat back surface. You should also get a small tube of the E6000 glue with applicator tips. It will make it easier to work with the small size rhinestones. All these items can be found at your local craft store on, or on Amazon. Before you start gluing your rhinestones and appliques, separate them equally to ensure you're adding the same amount to each side of your coat. Since I would like the applique to show in the front and back, I will position it around the neckline and ensure that the middle of the applique is right on the shoulder line. I use a small paintbrush to apply the glue to the back. Position it and press. Do the same on the other side. Now it's time for the rhinestones. Start with the large ones and place them randomly. I'm starting close to the front opening of the coat and go all the way to the shoulder seam. Once you've placed them where you'd like, Start gluing them in place by using your glue tube with applicator tip. Next, glue the small rhinestones to fill in the gaps. By the way, I use tweezers to place the small rhinestones. It's just a bit less messy. I decided to add a rhinestone trim to the shoulder seam because my coat is kimono style, which makes it easy to lay flat and glue on. I don't recommend adding a trim to the shoulder seam and sleeve if your coat has regular armholes and sleeves. Add a trim on a coat with raglan sleeves or that is kimono style like mine. Since I'm in the holiday spirit, I'm adding more small rhinestones to give my coat this I'm here look. By the way, let the glue set overnight. And voila, another super easy and fun DIY upcycling project. If you like this DIY, hit the like button. If you're new to my channel, subscribe and please share with a friend. And don't forget to tag me if you try it. Mm -hmm. 